So, um, I think the saga, dropout saga, has been solved. Um, just got finished with the workout. Um, it was pretty much a 10 watt increase every five minutes. Um, just a quick workout. And um, based on last week, or the last ride where it was Wi Fi issues, I uh, deleted the Wi Fi connection to the Garmin and uh, did the workout today and as you see right here on the graph um, there was oddly there was a dropout right up towards the beginning and then right towards the end but essentially no dropout at all um, for some reason and i, I don't understand it because the amp plus signal is a separate uh, signal or channel different than uh, wi-fi but uh, we den deleted the wi-fi from interacting with the closed circuit of the Garmin and the kicker, and it worked flawlessly this time. Um, power felt smooth the whole time in uh, the intervals, uh, which makes sense because with dropout, the, when it hits zero and I'm supposed to be at, say, 200 watts, it's always gonna compensate, go harder, and so it'll be this fluctuation where the power uh, will not feel smooth. But everything worked out great. Uh, I'm gonna send uh, the file to Garmin, or to, uh, to Wahoo, and uh, let those guys know uh, just really odd circumstance and uh, why is a closed uh, system um, having interference with uh, and a direct correlation with uh, the Wi-Fi signal. So it's deleted, it's fixed. Um, now I'm a happy camper. So I actually even bought a Element Roam um, to attempt to remedy the situation. Fortunately, I did not have to use it kind of figuring out this uh, Wi-Fi situation. But um, all is good now, and um, let the training continue. Thanks, guys. This is K-Squared Cycling, decoy 